Okay, today I'm heading out to prune the blueberries. As I mentioned in past videos, it's very cloudy today in the December. And uh, some hand pruning using these pruners here. So let's head out. 32 degrees, not too bad. like the deer got through here again. I'll have to come back and fix that. The deer are a nuisance up here. I don't know what they want, but they try to get in here. Alright, maybe they're out here somewhere. So what I am after pruning is the briars and uh, <clears throat> other garbage stuff that's in the blueberries. I don't know if I can do this with one hand, but here we go. So I'm going to walk down. I want to get the wild, uh, wild cherries out of here, most important. Come back later. So here's one right here, as you can see, they really take over. So I am going to see if I can do this with one hand and cut it down. No, easy one hand. Okay, there we go. So this is what takes over out here. Look at the thorns on here. Look at that. Look at the thorns. Horrible. That actually go right through the wheel of my tractor. So I'll take a brush hog through here and mow them down. I throw them in the middle. There's another wild cherry here. Let's see if we can get that one. So this is part of the maintenance of the blueberry farm. And like I said before, let me see if I can get this. Before I took over this blueberry farm, this place was full of this kind of stuff. There we go. So, how can I tell this is not blueberry bush? Take a look at the bark, it has little spots on it, little lines. Now, take a look at a blueberry bush. See the difference? <clears throat> so, it's full of them here. Uh, I got a few acres of pruning to do. No, it's not too bad out here though. So look at look at look at them all here. <clears throat> look at all these here. So if you don't cut these, you grow like weeds. This is a year's growth. This right here. They just take over. It's not easy doing this at one hand, so I'm going to have to say, I'm going to keep going here. But anyway, this is what it's all about. Okay, there we go. Now I just take these and throw them out in the middle. And the brush hog will cut them. There's more here. Look, it's full of them all through here. So this is what it looks like out in... If you can see it out in the blueberry field in the end of December. Blueberry bush as far as you can see here. It's still very peaceful out here even in the winter. So that's what I'm doing today. All right, everybody. 
Hope you enjoyed this video. This is part of the maintenance. Oh, and by the way, also I'll be pruning the blueberries. Just want to get the, the crap out of the blueberries first, like this stuff here. Because that really takes over and chokes out the blueberries. But later on, oh, another one here. Look at this. Look at this stuff. This has got to come out too, these briars. So later on, I'll be pruning this, this stuff like this here. This is old. <clears throat> old uh, blueberry branches that just sucks the energy out of the blueberries so this stuff here look at that it's old old stuff most people say that you should replace the blueberries every 40 years i don't know how old these blueberry bushes are i'm guessing it's from the 1970s they were planted here i'm not sure but what I found is, if you want to rejuvenate the blueberry bush, keep pruning the back. You can prune them pretty harsh, and they come back better than ever. Uh, that's what I did when I first bought this property with the blueberries. And uh, I'm hoping for a good next year's crop of blueberries here. We'll see. I noticed my camera is just into the light here. It's not a very good day to video. So I hope you can see everything. So anyway, I uh, thank you for stopping by the Blueberry Farm. And please like, share, and subscribe. Tells you are enjoying what you are viewing here. I'll get out here more when I can and show you more what it's like to maintain and grow blueberries on a blueberry farm. I know I've been veering off a little bit doing other exploring areas, but it is off season. And uh, this is what I do. Okay, thanks for stopping by. Stop by again soon. Bye for now.